face palm. Ah, <laughs> this is just the best this subreddit will ever get. <laughs> Hey everyone, my name is Jake and welcome to r slash facepalm where we look at the stupidity of other people online so we feel much better about ourselves. You should also subscribe if you haven't already, uh, that would be pretty epic. And here's a quick disclaimer. A popular nature Facebook page for boomers posted an animatronic at Disney. This photo is too beautiful not to be seen by everyone. Ah. <sighs> It, it's still nice, I guess. At least they tried. <laughs> New York bans unvaccinated children from going to school, and their anti-vax parents are furious. Ah, back to the time of segregation. You thought this was done. No, it's not for the color of your skin now. It's your medical choices. <laughs> Yeah guys, remember if you're not vaccinated, you're being discriminated against by all those healthy loser kids. <laughs> Saving two seconds by rushing the light. Oh. <laughs> it looks like it's run over venom or something. <laughs> Quote on quote, your package has been shipped. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm bothered by the fact that he's not looking through the gap he made in the blinds. <laughs> I just realized that. Now, that's actually because he doesn't want to get dust in his nose. You know, 200 IQ right there. Nickelback copyright strike Donnie's meme using their song. <laughs> Donald Trump literally made a Nickelback meme of look at this photograph. Oh my. <laughs> well, hopefully now that he's been personally affected, he'll, he'll make the copyright laws much better and I can start to use memes in my videos more. So I was trying to Google that scene in Pirates of the Caribbean where Jack and Will are walking underwater with the robo over their heads cause it looks cool and I wanna try it. But the thing is, I googled boat scene in Pirates of the Caribbean. <laughs> I mean, that scene does make me want to try it out too, but yeah, I can see where the facepalm comes in. <laughs> Just because the monitor shows one security camera at a time doesn't mean they ain't all recording. <laughs> ah, all that for just a couple of dollars. It's not worth it, is it? <laughs> Please give me an example of something someone said to you that was so astonishingly stupid that you can never forget it. I wrote an article about poverty on a Native American reservation, and someone sent me an article titled 10 Indian Billionaires, and said, then explain this, and they were all people from India. <laughs> Well, even if they were Native American billionaires, th that's still not how poverty works. <laughs> a high school with a parking lot. You know you have gone too far into liberalism when your teenager can drive car to go to school. Dude, the teachers need cars to get to the school. Wouldn't it be nice to have a place to park your car? <laughs> um, don't older kids do this everywhere? Like, I, I didn't realize it was a new concept. I literally drove to school every day when I was in high school. <laughs> Hello, blank. I just want to ask a question. Why are you using my name as your account name? Because it's my name? <laughs> Wow, two people can have the same name? What? New bubble wrap will no longer pop when you squeeze it. No, no, why would they do this? This, this will hurt sales, I'm telling you. <laughs> High school in a picture. Anyone do the homework? What's the homework? We had homework? Oh, <laughs> I think we've all been there at least once. <laughs> Woman keys up a Tesla and gets caught by its nine built-in cameras. <laughs> oh, these boomers don't understand that all these cars have got cameras now. You can't just go around keying things. She definitely deserves to get arrested or something. 
If Lily Potter had an abortion, then who would stop Voldemort? Uh, Neville Longbottom. Jesus Christ, read the books. <laughs> It's nice that she cites Harry Potter as one of the reasons she is against abortions, and not any like, I don't know, science? <laughs> Perfectly cooked rare chicken steak. <laughs> uh, I just have this clip of Gordon Ramsay screaming, it's raw, in my head. <laughs> How to hide from the police like a pro. No, no, don't tell me he's there. <laughs> This is like some five-year-old's hide-and-seek tactic. D did he actually think that would work? <laughs> Elderly woman mistakenly prays to League of Legends character. <laughs> no, there's no accident right there. She knew what she was doing. <laughs> um, unnatural hair colors in women are a warning signal to stay away. It's an example of aposmatism, the phenomenon of poisonous animals in nature advertising their toxicity and lethality. Apositism is there to warn off predators, not potential partners. If you're repelled by it, it's working. <laughs> this is the same guy that said like gaming is for losers. I think he's just a bit of a loser himself. <laughs> He probably got rejected by someone with red hair two years ago and he's still mad over it. He's like, ah, I'm gonna take my hatred to Twitter. Ah. As an employer, why shouldn't I be able to hire teens for free? What else are they going to do during the summer months? Me hiring them for free, and maybe me receiving a stipend from the government for doing so, means that I am keeping teens off the street, keeps the crime rate down, and prevents addiction in the future. Screw this. These kids are also getting experience. I am educating them out of my pocket. Yes, I was fine today for not paying my staff a wage, and I am angry. <laughs> this man is literally asking for slavery back. What? Water, one mile away. Water, one kilometer away. Americans be like, haha. <laughs> But the Americans are right. A mile is less than a kilometer. One mile is 1.6 kilometers. <laughs> well, he can do the conversion, just not the maths. <laughs> Never actually knew there was a difference between then and than. Always thought people just used that when they wanted their sentences to look American or something. <laughs> Well, I guess people use grey instead of grey if you want to be American, but I don't think it applies to then and then. <laughs> Add one of two. Ah, oh, I have to watch a few ads for free content. Then it's not free, is it? Well, it still is. <laughs> you don't have to spend any money. I mean, feel free to pay whatever it is for YouTube Premium a month so you don't have to watch ads. Or you can go to television and watch four minutes of ads per five minutes of content because I'm pretty sure that's how they work. <laughs> Do you know what would be amazing if, if you guys got an ad like midway through that? But I'll probably get demonetized, so it's fine. <laughs> All right, youngster, you gotta keep your eyes on the ball. Just make sure you keep them on it at all times and you'll do really well. No. <laughs> oh, he's trying so hard. That's so cute. Uh, I don't think that's gonna fit. <laughs> no, we don't need to bring the van. It'll fit really easy in my car. Does it work for Mac? Um, does your Mac have a mouse? If it does, then it will work. It's a mouse pad. <laughs> I was like, oh, maybe they're asking a good question, something that might not work on Macs, just Windows. And then it's a mouse pad. <laughs> this reminds me of the one where somebody asked if protein powder is safe for women. <laughs> Price is right contestant in wheelchair wins treadmill. <laughs> well, I guess it's time to run on your arms, I guess. <laughs> this person that posted this saw one of their relatives post this. <laughs> My generation will start a revolution. Uh, your generation can't even do a full working week. Decide whether your boy, girl, or alien eat meat without crying. Wake up! 
I can't even begin to explain this one. Let's just go on to the next one. <laughs> Anti-racism event hosted by Edinburgh University bans white people from asking questions. <laughs> well, that just sounds like racism with extra steps, I guess. Oh, also, we got the trailer for the new season of Rick and Morty, so I'm kind of hyped. I'm kind of hyped. If you don't watch it, you've got no idea what I'm talking about, <laughs> but it's good. You should watch it. Stop injecting healthy children with mercury-filled vaccines. There was no autism before. You know nothing about autism. Years ago, autistic people were diagnosed as having mental disorders because no one understood autism. This is why no one heard of it years ago. Um, I have a master's degree in education and I've seen a huge increase in autism, so I think I do know. Oh, I mean, by that logic, the Earth is flat, and don't at me because I have a master's in astrology. Ah, <laughs> oh, Coral Springs is annoying me with this darn fire truck, and all these police cars blocking off the darn street. SMH. Oh, sorry for the inconvenience. We were out saving multiple patients who were badly hurt in a car crash. We need room to work. <laughs> I seriously don't understand their logic. Like, they're saying, Oh, you're ruining the scenery. Oh, if they didn't want to be hurt in the first place, they would have never crashed. Ah. Oh. Big brain. Emergency phone not installed. Please do not have an emergency at this location. <laughs> I can just see that the stats on screen right now. Emergency rate drops to zero. <laughs> Follow us to quality parking. Yep, <laughs> I'm not following them anywhere. <laughs> I bet they're regretting that sticker now. Germs are not a real thing. Fox News host says he hasn't washed his hands in 10 years. He denies existence of germs saying, I can't see them, therefore they're not real. <sighs> I think he should go prove it. Go lick inside a toilet bowl or something. They're, then tell us they're not real. <laughs> Here we have an ad for some Nandi Agua. <laughs> Packaged drinking water. Now water with H2O. <laughs> I kind of want to know what was in the water before. <laughs> My grandpa ziplining. I don't think anyone told him to hold on. <laughs> I mean, he looks like he's having fun. <laughs> Either that or he's no longer with us. <laughs> Hey everyone, if you want to check out a similar video to that, then click on screen right now. And if you want to see some epically funny jokes, follow me on Twitter at FakeJakeYT. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you very soon.